In today's video, I'm going to show you how to upload a customer list in Google Ads. If you find this video useful, please consider liking and subscribing. Let's get right into it. So the first thing we need to go ahead and do is log into our Google Ads account like I've done here. Now, your Google Ads account and dashboard should look very similar. It depends what version of Google you're on and it depends um, if you're on the ex expert mode or not. So. Once we're in Google like this, what we need to do is we need to look on the left hand side for this bar here. And all we need to go to is tools here. Now under tools, there's going to be a few different options here. The one we're looking for is shared library. Inside here, we want to go over to this section here called audience manager. So go ahead and click on that. Inside here, you should see all of the audience that you already have. You're going to see things like your data segments, audiences, custom segments, etc, etc. Now for us to go ahead and upload a customer list, what we need to do is press on this blue plus icon here. There's going to be a ton of different options on this drop down here. And the one that we want to go ahead and click on is customer list. So go ahead and click on that. And then from here, you're going to go ahead and get a few options. So it's going to ask you what data source you want to use to add your customer list. You can either connect a new data source. So this would be something like a a website or somewhere that's going to feed data or you can upload a file manu manually so this is things like a csv file containing the customers names and details that kind of thing lastly what we can do is we can click skip this step and set up source later this is if we don't have it so for now i'm going to go ahead and click on this at this point it's going to ask us for some details number one is the segment name so just name this so you can see what it is it's going to ask you next for the customer type so this is going to allow you to define what they are. So are they purchasers? Is it all customers? Is it high value customers, qualified leads, paid subscribers, cart abandoners? You need to categorize it as best as possible as this will help them with their retargeting and that kind of stuff. And then you've got your membership duration. So this is how long you want them to stay in your database. And lastly, you have the segment description. So this is to keep it all um, sorted so you can understand it easily when you come back to it. Once you're happy, go ahead and press save and continue. And that should be your Google customer list updated and added to your account. So if you enjoyed the video and found it useful, be sure to go down below and like and subscribe. Comment down below that it helped and I'll see you in the next one.